afternoon, I'm Adriana Michelle, and today on Up North at Four, a few falcon chicks, part of a restorative program, have finally learned to fly, officially joining the class of 2020. Then Peyton's Promise Executive Director, Tina Medic, will tell us how the charity will stock the shelves of Marathon County food pantries. Plus, this time last year, I learned how to shoot a bow and arrow. Ladies can learn too this weekend by joining the Wisconsin Women Archers Weekend. So all that in a bit, but first, here's your top four at four. Vice President Mike Pence entered the Wisconsin battleground today to speak on important issues for the state's GOP. Pence kicked off President Donald Trump's campaign with a pair of appearances in Waukesha County to focus on school choice and religious faith. Pence held a roundtable discussion on charter and private voucher schools at Waukesha STEM Academy with Education Secretary Betsy DeVos. The 73rd Alice in Dairyland representative has been selected by the Department of Agriculture, Trade and Consumer Protection. Juliet Nunez of Chippewa Falls was selected as the 73rd Alice at the culmination of 2020 final, final events near Milwaukee. She will work as a communications professional for the department, uh, educating the public about the importance of agriculture in Wisconsin. UW Stevens Point is taking part in a nationwide program to improve environments and awareness of threatened bee and pollinator species. Now certified as a Bee Campus USA, the school will provide pollinating insects and birds with a healthy habitat, rich in a variety of native plants, and free or nearly free of pesticides. UW Stevens Point is one of three certified cam campuses in the state and the only one within the UW system. North Central Technical College will welcome students back to its campuses for the fall semester, scheduled September 3rd. Students will have the opportunity to select from in-person classes, virtual college classes, and hybrid courses, courses offered through Zoom. The college will rely on physical distancing in classrooms and mask requirements requirements for everyone on campus. The college has also adjusted room capacities and added sections to allow for physical distancing in classroom and lab spaces. Hey Devin, it's cloudy outside again today. When will the sun come out? Maybe sooner than you think. How, how do you like Thursday? Because that will be when we will be seeing all the sunshine coming out. We, we saw some clouds in parts of Stevens Point. Now we're seeing a few showers moving through too across parts of Portage County, a little bit in Wood County and Adams County. But look further to the north. Really, we don't have anything moving through at all at this moment. Nothing really going on, at least for our northern parts of the state. Now let's put this in motion. We have a few clouds moving through too. Some of it's starting to clear out. So some of you are seeing some sun, others not so much. This is as our next boundary is currently passing through. Spark off a few scattered showers and thunderstorms. Now here's a wider look. Here's where the cold front is. It's moving through right now. That little boundary here, I didn't draw it on here, but it's right there. Then we have this next system. It's going to track off these two. So things are going to remain busy, but a few breaks are, are, are on the way. Now check this out. Here's that Saharan dust from Africa. Again, we were talking about it's really noticeable on the visible satellite today. And guess where it's headed? You guessed it, right in, in, in our own backyard. It's going to be heading up on shore. Then it's going to be hitting the United States really good, including, yes, here in Wisconsin, too. We'll be seeing some very beautiful sunsets from that, which will also inhibit any tropical development, too, and maybe even inhibit some rain development across our neck of the woods. So as that dust moves in, maybe I'd see a little bit of drop off in the precipitation chances. Highs today so far cooler. We're in the middle 60s at the moment. If, oh, the only 70 degree reading is in Wausau and in Wisconsin Rapids. Temperature right now or definitely a little war cooler though 63 degrees in Rhinelander, 69 degrees in Phillips and again 63 degrees over in Manitowish waters. We're going to work on those temperatures. Some good news in store 71 degrees by Wednesday warming all the way up to 83 degrees by Tuesday. So as we kind of jump things through throughout the next several hours, the showers will get out of here. Clouds should thin out for a little while but as we head towards Wednesday again, more shower development will be possible. So your hour by hour forecast coming up for tonight. Temperatures will be dropping and the clouds will thin out for a little bit too, hitting a refreshing 48 degrees. We'll be back in a bit. 
Save big money in your next project with 11% off everything right now at Menards. All Patriot Lighting ceiling fans are 11% off. This Miller Station 52-inch LED ceiling fan features an industrial appearance with vintage-style bulbs. One fourteen eighty one after 11% off. Over 120 in stock Sylvania LED bulbs are 11% off. These bulbs use 85% less energy than traditional 60-watt bulbs. Five thirty one after 11% off. Start saving with 11% off everything now at Menards. Save big money at Menards. Special guest Eric Stone Street drops by AGT. For a head-turning, high-flying surprise. My jaw was on this table. Got talent tonight on NBC. Tonight. We're not ready to go home. This is it. We have ten groups. Only four go through. Their last chance to show them everything they've got. Earn it. Let's earn it. World of Dance. Tonight on NBC. And every Friday, catch a World of Dance encore with exclusive content. High Point Sand and Gravel provides high quality riprap, sand, and screened topsoil for almost any need. The high quality rock and stone, boulders, and clear stone enhance the function and beauty of your home or business. Offering convenient delivery or pickup throughout northern Wisconsin and the UP, High Point Sand and Gravel provides premium landscaping materials specializing in producing beautiful decorative stone for all types of landscaping projects. Contact High Point Sand and Gravel to help make your next project a dream come true. Joe Biden's trade deals with China cost Wisconsin nearly 89,000 jobs, but it doesn't stop there. Listen. I'm supporting NAFTA because I think it is a positive thing to do. NAFTA shipped our jobs to Mexico, closed our factories, and after 20 years, would Biden fix his mistake? Do you support renegotiating NAFTA? No. Over 200,000 Wisconsin jobs lost. Joe Biden, he's been wrong for too long. America First Action is responsible for the content of this advertising. This portion of News Watch 12 is brought to you by Kitchen Bath Mart. You're watching Up North at 4. It's Tuesday, June 23rd. Grab yourself a cup of tea or coffee because it's tea time here in the North Woods. Devin, you look a little bit comfortable just sitting back. I am back. comfortable. Just sitting back enjoying the couch because isn't that what the couch is for? Exactly. <laughs> and it, that's what tea time is for. Sitting yeah. back, relaxing, and seeing what's going on in the North Woods. Yeah, let's see what's going on in the North Woods. <laughs> All right. First, we asked you guys to send um, pictures of your adorable pooches to celebrate your love for them and i want to show you one uh, that was sent from us uh from debbie sanders flesser i think her last name is now she says her zoe loves watching up north at four and that's her little zoe watching me jeff and theo oh it's so cute so we really appreciate when you guys send us pictures like this and again if you guys have pictures that uh, you want to sh send and share with us with your adorable pooches send them in because we want to show them off yeah yeah we don't want theo again today but his fur is still here so he's here with us in spirit and jeff <laughs> will be back tomorrow and i'm sure he'll have theo and Raoul, and we'll, we'll definitely be able to catch up with theo he's here with us in fur right yeah, <laughs> in <love> fur today. <laughs> All right, the Falcon Chicks in the WPS and We Energy's Falcon program have reached a huge milestone. The Chicks have learned to fly and officially joined the class of 2020. So Blaze was the first Chick to spread his wings. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Look at them. So there's three of them and one is about to take flight. His younger brother, Hoppy, was actually the last one to take flight. Oh wow, look at that. I'm just like caught in all by looking at it. That's really cool when you see birds learning to fly for the first Aww. time. All three oh, chicks were named in honor of our favorite things uh, in, uh, about Wisconsin. Um, the fledgings will spend the next few weeks learning how to hunt, prey, and mastering their flying skills. After that, they'll head off in separate directions to start their own lives. And <laughs> this year's class of chicks uh, brings a total number of uh, uh, peregrines hatched, named and banded at the WPS and We Energy's platform power plant to 410 since their recovery efforts began in the mid 1990s. Now that is really cool to see WPS and WE Energies. They're doing great things for the environment, not only in animals, but if you saw our special, we were talking about solar energy too. So yeah. they're doing great things across Wisconsin, both in keeping our keeping in the state safe and even helping out with even with nature too. Yeah, for this program is a, a part of a statewide effort to restore the falcon population. So it's really good to see 
that it's actually working. And 400, a total of 410, I mean, that's a lot of Falcons. That is a lot of Falcons. I'm sure that number is going to keep growing as they keep doing this. Yep. All right, the Merrill Area Chamber of Commerce has announced that their Back in Business a Better promotion has been extended until June 30th. So how does it work? It is super simple. Just stop at uh, a, stop in at a locally owned business, snap a photo of your receipt or something in the establishment, and then email the photo, the business name, and your name to ken at merrillchamber.org. The chamber will share your photo on its Facebook page and enter you to win some money. They'll be giving away four or $500 grants to local businesses and $20, $50 chamber gift certificates to people who enter and you have to be at least 18 year, years or older and there will be a, draw, a drawing on Facebook uh, uh, at 12 noon on July 2nd to we find out make who the you winner. Enter it. <laughs> yeah, that means I need to go to Merrill and go into one of the restaurants or uh, you know any sort of local establishment, snap a picture and send it their way. That's really who, who doesn't like winning money. <laughs> I won't object to that. <laughs> I wouldn't object to that either. Can, can I win the lotto, please? <laughs> right, right. <laughs> <laughs> that would help. Yeah. That would help a lot. But also, Rhinelander uh, Chamber of Co Commerce last week, they announced a new eight week long campaign urging residents to help support and revive local businesses. Now the chamber is asking people to utilize its digital toolkit toolkit and take the buy local pledge. Now the toolkit can be found on the chamber webpage, which will give you fun Facebook frames and social media graphics. You've seen the social media frames that you can put over your profile picture. Yeah, yeah I've seen those many times. Uh, with uh, many other uh, cop movements and such. So they have that and they also have this uh, buy local pledge which you see on your screen now. It encourages you to dine locally at least once during Eat Local Week, shop at a local store uh, ordering over ordering online and you can spend at least $25 during a local uh, shop. What is it? Local Local shop, we there got you blanking go. out too. I hear, I hear Paul in my pledge. ear right now. I feel like he's trying to tell me something I can't hear. Am I? <laughs> I think he said you're out of time. Okay. <laughs> All right, let me wrap this up. And then uh, overall, they just want you to explore in your own backyard. So I think we're out of time. Uh, I'm going to take a quick break. We'll be right back after this, so stay with us. Right now, it feels like the world's standing still. But if you look to the land, it's a whole different story. From farms to backyards, seeds are being planted, animals are getting fed, grass is growing, and families are giving their all to the soil because the land never stops. So to all those linked to the land, we say thank you. We're here for you because we all run together. Stop by Lakeland Lawn and Equipment in Arborvita for special offers taking place for a limited time. Hi, I'm Dr. Justin Sher, DC with the Spinal Aid Center of Wausau. Are you one of the millions of people suffering with the symptoms of peripheral neuropathy? Your symptoms may include numbness and tingling in your feet or hands, difficulty sleeping from leg or foot discomfort, and debilitating balance problems. I have good news for you. You can now get relief with our breakthrough treatment method without the use of drugs or surgery. Our treatments help to heal damaged nerves that cause peripheral neuropathy. If left untreated, you may eventually end up with a walker or wheelchair. So don't delay. Call our office now to schedule an appointment to see if our treatment methods are right for you. We will do a painless neuropathy severity exam to determine the amount of nerve loss. If you qualify for our treatment, it can truly change your life. Start living your life pain free. Call today. Looking for a new home? See how you can customize at North Country Homes. The four foot by six foot walk-in ceramic showers have been real popular. And we're seeing a lot more different trim and cabinet colors coming into the market. It's always a good feeling seeing a family move into the new home and their family enjoying it. Let our family make your family a home. Homes you can feel good about. North Country Homes. Welcome back to Up North at Four. This is your daily tea time here in the North Woods. Now, Peyton's Promise has a mission to eradicate, eradicate hunger in Marathon County, and it is making one large effort tomorrow. Here to tell us about the initiative is Executive Director Tina Medic. Tina, welcome to Up North at Four. How are you? 
Great, thanks so much for having me. Absolutely, so how long has the, uh, the organization been running? Oh, well, my daughter just graduated from college, Peyton. Oh, congratulations. congratulations. Um, yeah, thank you very much. Uh, UW La Crosse, she graduated from, and um, she started when she was eight years old. So wow. the organization's been around a long time. So you've been uh, really helping spread awareness uh, about hunger in the area, and you help uh, stock the shelves of food pantries. You help a lot of different uh, families in the area. And tomorrow, there's going to be one huge sort of donation, and you're teaming up with two businesses. Do you want to uh, tell us about that? Yeah. Um, so, you know, our three initiatives are to raise awareness about the problem of hunger, um, which we do through social media outlets, through these no news programs. You guys have been always so supportive of us, and we are grateful for that. Um, we keep the sh food pantry sh stocked, and then we also um, help to fight childhood obesity by collecting and donating healthy food items. So we started with one food pantry, and now we're up to supporting 53 food pantries in Marathon County, wow. um, between wow. school pantries and community pantries. Um, we started with one little girl and her brother um, collecting food, and now we have over 183 kids that are running this organization and really fueling the fire behind it. So tomorrow, we're really excited. Um, COVID-19, you know, definitely we had to kind of change the way we did things. The kids are used to collecting those food items at food drives. Um, so we really, um, really kind of pushed the whole donations. Um, and we've been stocking the pantries with the, the items that they're needing. Um, but tomorrow, we're actually donating to 23 pantries from, um, we're making the purchases at Pick and Save in Weston and mm -hmm. Quick Trip in Schofield as well. And we are going to be providing enough food for about 1,400 families. Wow. Wow, that is a lot. Those numbers are just so big. It, is, it, it sounds like it started small and just grew very fast. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's amazing to watch, you know, we watched our daughter grow up and then our son grow up with the program, mm -hmm. but now I, I have just as much pride um, with the kids that are running um, the program now. So, you know, I live in Minneapolis. After Peyton graduated high school, we moved over to Minneapolis, so I do everything remotely from here, but they are actually the feet on the ground, so I think I've got three of our leaders at each of the stores, as well as a couple of board members uh -huh. um, that are going to be helping to load those cars as they pull in, because it's a lot of food. And, mm -hmm. you know, we really kind of focus our energy on stocking those smaller pantries, as well as the bigger pantries like Salvation Army and the Neighbor's Place, too. Right, so tomorrow you guys will be at the a quick trip in Weston and then a pick and save in Schofield? Um, I, you know, I don't know where that, that border line is there, but um, They're pretty you know, close. I lived in Weston, so it was all Weston to me. But um, yes, we'll be at both of those locations between 12 and 1.30 loading up those cars. Mm -hmm. Quick trip, um, you know, the one reason we reached out to them when they opened up that, that site, um, it used to be called like Callan Station or something, you used to get great ice cream there, and they turned it into a quick trip. And they opened up and made a donation to us years ago. Uh -huh. And we always said we wanted to kind of give back and, and work with them. And then we found out that Quick Trip, all of their dairy items are bought through local farmers. Mm -hmm. So when we started getting into this pandemic, we were like, gosh, how can we give back to help these local farmers and be able to support them as well? So I reached out to our friends at Quick Trip and they're like, absolutely. So they're bringing a semi in, they're gonna provide milk, eggs, butter, and cheese curds. Um, you know, what good Wisconsinite doesn't like cheese curds, right? Yeah, right, you gotta have the cheese curds. <laughs> And then um, Pick and Save is going to, they they brought in um, cereal, pasta, pasta sauce, mm -hmm. um, ravioli, and canned fruit. Tina, so, you know, it sounds like, you know, you are going to do a great job tomorrow. I'm so sorry. I have to, have, I'm out of time, but I can talk your ear off. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate I appreciate you, uh, you know, stocking the pantries, and um, I look forward to seeing all the good things that are to come with the organization. Keep up the good work. You 
well. I can't thank you guys enough. You know, we couldn't spread our message without people like you that are, are putting it out there for the world to see that might just inspire somebody else to make a donation to their local food pantry. So thank you for all you do. Thank you. We're going to take a quick break. When we return, Lady Archers, get ready for a big shooting weekend starting this Saturday. Would you rather have hiccups for a week or the worst haircut ever? That's a lose-lose. But at Taco John's, choose three chicken street tacos or three chicken soft shell tacos for just five bucks. Win-win. Taco John's. Bigger. Bolder. Better. Play your way. Dine your way. Stay your way. Ho-Chunk Gaming Wittenberg. Win your way. Northland Basement Systems is the all-things basementy company. Basement waterproofing, basement finishing, basement structural repair, humidity and mold control, and nasty crawl spaces too. When it comes to basement solutions, nobody does it better than we do. Since 1991, homeowners just like you in the Northland have trusted Northland Basement Systems for all things basementy in their homes. Call Northland Basement Systems today to schedule a free home evaluation. As we say goodbye to winter and greet spring, it's the ideal time for an ISA certified arborist to prep your Northwoods land for warm weather fun. Custom caretaking and landscaping is equipped with a 90-foot spider lift to assist with tree service needs. The open road, the wind in your hair, the feeling of freedom that drives us to go out and discover. At Chevy, we're committed to getting you there with confidence and peace of mind. That's why your Chevy Clean Dealers commit to using enhanced vehicle cleaning measures with CDC-approved cleansers. If you need a new Equinox, get 0% APR for 72 months or $4,500 cash allowance on most models. You may even shop online and take delivery at home where available, so you can find new roads with confidence. Welcome back. This time last year, I learned to do something that I never thought I would do. That would be shooting a bow and arrow. Let's have a look. So what's, what is the first step? Well, what we're going to do first is give you some finger tabs. So put it on your right hand. There you go. Okay. Three fingers in. Three fingers. And, and bring it around. All right. Got That's it. Great. And this is going to go, would you hold this please? Thank sure. you. Your help. <laughs> okay. So, oh. There we go. This is an arm protector uh, so that your string doesn't come around and give you a smack. Uh-oh, we don't want that to happen now. I don't want that to happen. I'm going to turn it or now. Or do we? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Be nice, you're, Jeff. Okay. You are a difficult man today, aren't you? <laughs> Every day. <laughs> Every day. Okay. That okay. Looks good. This is All good right. to go. Now we'll do hand over. And I, I have a little uh, hip quiver here, but she's okay. got her, boat, her arrows in her real quiver. And I got my arrows. One of the things you want to be able to do is put the arrow on here without being too awkward. Okay. So you're going to hold the bow here and I'll get an arrow out for you. Thank you. And you'll just lay it across the bow. Okay. And put it in the notch. Right here? Mm hmm Okay. And before you, yeah, go ahead. Like this? I'm not going to let go of the arrow just yet, but go okay. ahead and pull it. Pull it back. Turn it up. Turn and it up like this? And then before you do anything else. <gasps> oh, there goes the, can there you goes put, the arrow. Can you put it back can on? Can I put your arrow back on? Oh, that happens all the time. Okay. Just lean it a little bit this way. Okay. And don't pull yet. But oh, you're going to bring that the tip of this back as close to your cheekbone as you can, or your bottom Okay. Leg. Oh! <laughs> okay, ready? Push, push out. It happens. Oh, oh my goodness! It I did it! Yeah. Did you guys okay. see that? That feels awesome. I'm going to do it one more time. Jeff, do you think you could do this? Uh, no, this is a women's event. I'm going to stay out of this one. You guys got this. Alright, I did it. That's pretty awesome. This feels good. Uh, now, you got to bring it back to your anchor point, uh, oh, uh, which is going to be, oh, maybe maybe your cheekbone or close to <laughs> I'm struggling here. Okay. And push out. Here we go. And push with your left. <laughs> I think you're two an for archer. Two. <laughs> I think I'm a natural. I think I'm it's here, Slumberland's huge clearance event. You do not want to miss this one. Massive markdowns all over. 
closeouts, floor samples, one-of-a-kind items, crazy low prices like sofas as low as $278, this gorgeous bed on closeout for only $148, or this classic sectional for just $799. Plus, get totally free doorstep shipping. No contact, no minimum. Hurry into our huge clearance event and save. Only at Slumberland Furniture. It was in February, I was playing pond hockey and literally had to be helped up. Uh, I was in constant pain after that. So I came to Dr. Drager and uh, they started me uh, on the laser treatment. I realized as I've gone through this, every day I was feeling better and I am so happy with, uh, with uh, coming to see Dr. Drager. Contact Drager Chiropractic in Eagle River to see if high intensity laser treatment is right for you. Call 715-479-5995. From all of us at American Marine and Motorsports, we want you to know that we are still open and still all about family. Our current inventory should accommodate the growing needs of quality family time this summer more than ever. Go to AmericanMarina.com and search our huge variety of pontoons, fishing boats, crown line and Malibu fiberglass boats or call ahead and make an appointment. We guarantee the best pricing and take advantage of low interest rates. American Marina and Motorsports, Shawano, we stand with you. Stay safe. Young's Golf Course in Iron River is waiting to challenge your golf game with 18 championship holes featuring blind greens, dog legs, and deep bunkers nestled along beautiful Chicago Lake. Young's is proud to feature great golf at affordable prices, so everyone is welcome to come play. Relive the round with some drinks and fantastic food at the Firebrick Bar and Grill overlooking the course and Chicago Lake. Young's Golf Course in Iron River, a truly special experience. Special guest Eric Stone Street drops by AGT for a head turning, high flying surprise. My jaw was on this table. Got talent tonight on NBC. Tonight. We're not ready to go home. This is it. We have 10 groups, only four go through. Their last chance to show them everything they've got. Earn it, let's earn it. World of Dance, tonight on NBC. And every Friday, catch a World of Dance encore with exclusive content. Before the break, you saw me shoot a bow and arrow pretty well. Uh, <laughs> this weekend, you can learn too if you're a woman because it's the second annual um, shooting weekend. And it's going to be in um, near Rib Mountain and sign up is $15. The email is on your screen if you want to sign up. It's going to be a really good time. It is definitely going to be a good time for those that do participate. I mean. I haven't done anything like that since high school. <laughs> well, maybe you should try once in a while. Sometime should, soon. Yeah, but not this weekend because for the yeah, ladies. Yes, yeah, for the ladies. <laughs> and just FYI, it's pink day and we are wearing pink. Just FYI. <laughs> all right, we'll see you back here tonight at 5 and 6 for all of your local news and weather. Have a good night.